Cat backhoe loaders are built for exceptional performance, versatility, and ease of operation. Safety is key at Caterpillar, so in the next few minutes, we're going to take you through how to safely operate your new cat machine. Before operating any machine, be sure to read and understand the safety and operating information inside your operations and maintenance manual. You will find your manual in the storage compartment on the left-hand side of the machine. Contact your local cat dealer if it is missing. Safety signs and decals are applied to several locations on your machine. Review, understand, and obey them. They are there for your protection. See your operations and maintenance manual for more details. Before beginning any job, ensure that you are wearing the proper personal protective equipment or PPE. This includes, but not limited to, a hard hat, safety glasses, high visibility vest, and safety shoes. Take the time to perform a quick survey of your job site to avoid any potential hazards. Never modify your machine with overinflated tires, foam filled tires, or attachments and counterweights that have not been approved by Caterpillar. To confirm an attachment is approved by Caterpillar, consult your operations and maintenance manual or local cat dealer. It is important that you know and understand the safety basics. You should also familiarize yourself with the machine features that are designed to protect you on the job site. To assist with entry and exit, you'll find three-point grab handles in addition to slip-resistant, heavy-duty, serrated steps. Always use three points of contact when climbing onto or climbing off of the machine. Always wear a seat belt. Make sure it is securely fastened and fits snugly. Other safety features include horns located in the front of the machine on the power shuttle lever and in the rear of the machine located on the left-hand backhoe joystick. Familiarize yourself with the parking brake. Before you begin operation of your new cap backhoe loader, ensure that you make the necessary seat, tilt steering wheel, and backhoe pod adjustments to safely perform your job task and to maintain operator comfort. If you must service your machine and work under the loader arms, you must use the lift arm safety brace to prevent the arms from lowering. To install the safety brace, first lower the lift arms placing any implements on the ground. Set the parking brake. Exit the backhoe cab maintaining three points of contact. Remove the safety brace retaining pin and gently lower the brace onto the cylinder. Re-enter the cab. Raise the loader arms until the brace drops into place. Reinstall the retaining pin. To remove the safety brace, slightly raise the loader arms, remove the retaining pin, raise and secure the safety brace into the storage position, and lower the loader arms. Every machine is equipped with a rollover protective structure or rocks. Never remove, modify, drill holes, or weld to it. Refer to your operations and maintenance manual for more information. When roading the cat backhoe loader, ensure the stabilizers are fully retracted, the boom has been raised and locked, and the swing lock pin has been installed. It is also recommended to transport the machine using two-wheel drive with four-wheel brake assist for improved stopping performance. If hauling the machine is necessary, refer to the operations and maintenance manual for details. Adhere to all state and local laws governing the weight, width, and length of the load. We cannot anticipate every potential hazardous situation, but here are some general do's and don'ts. Never overload your attachments. Read your machine and attachment operations and maintenance manual for operating instructions and limits. Always keep the attachment low for the best stability. Never take on a passenger. The machine is equipped for only one person, the operator. Never leave the operator seat when the engine is running. Never attempt to start the machine from outside the cab. Always keep your hands and feet inside the cab. Keep bystanders out of the line of fire, especially within the swing casting. When shutting down the machine, park the machine on a level ground. Lower the loader implements. Set the parking brake. Raise your boom and actuate the lock. You may choose to leave your stabilizers retracted. However, you should lower them if parking for extended periods of time. For more information on safely operating your new cat backhoe loader, be sure to contact your local cat dealer.